Hi, how are you? It's Yanita here, coming to you from Mile Zero Dance. Today I'm here with a dance class that is another one for junior high. But again, if you're not exactly that age and still want to take the class, you're more than welcome to join me. Today's class will be an exciting one because our theme today is balance. So we will be exploring different balances on different body parts as well as off balance. That to me sounds like there will be some risk taking involved. So do you have a little bit of space? Some clothes that you can easily move in? Awesome, sounds to me that we're ready to go. I think it's time for our warm up. Let's go. Take a deep breath in, eye gaze to the ceiling, breathe out, eye gaze to the floor. Breathe in, and out. Next time you exhale, Make sure that your knees and toes are 
go to the same direction. Two more. Next time, cross your right leg. Turn it around. Back to squat. And jump. And left leg. Turn it around. Take your step to the right. Left leg in the air. Lower down. Roll on your bum. And find your way up. How are you feeling? Warm? Good. So did you, did you notice those balances in our warm-up? What kinds of balances did we have? We had on two feet, on the balls of our two feet. Same for the one leg, one foot. What else? We had that star balance. And even a little bit, we might have balanced on our bum when we did that bum roll across. Good. So let's keep exploring other kinds of balances that we can have. So now you are in charge of your own movement. So you get to explore different ways of being in those balances. And I'm going to call out some body parts that we have to have on the floor or combinations of body parts. So we're going to have those body parts that I call on the floor and we're going to explore, keep moving in those balances. All right, let's try. Let's start with just one foot on the floor. How can you find your balance? How about on the ball of your one foot? Keep your balance. Spreading your fingers, having a curly on the floor, eye gaze in between your hands. 
how did it go? Which one was the most challenging one? I think maybe the hands, only hands, that was, at least for me, that was the most challenging one. Good. All right, let's keep exploring different balances as we learn a little dance together. So, contemporary dance uses a lot of floor work. So why don't we start on the floor and you can come to the left side of your space so that you have a little bit of space to move to the right. Your left leg will be bent, right leg will be extended. We're gonna start with a circle of our arms. So circle your arms. You're gonna have your hands on the floor. You're gonna go to your stomach and chest and push off that bent leg to your stomach and chest and to the same position on the opposite side. The same here. We're gonna circle the arms to the floor on your stomach and back. All right, I'm gonna add one more and then we'll review it from the beginning. We're gonna start the same way, circle the arms, but we're gonna put one hand behind us and we're gonna balance on one hand, one foot, and a heel. So we're gonna lift our hips, our other arm will be circling around, coming down, and you hook that straight leg in front of the bent one. All right, from the beginning, starting with the, with the arm circles. Circle to the floor, on the lower, the side of your lower leg. So from here, we'd be sliding, going over our knees, over our bum, and our to our feet, rolling up, okay? Or your second option is to find a balance only on your hand. I know, only on your hand. So that would mean that we do a little jump we land on the side of our lower leg as well. So from here, you could be doing a little jump, jump on your knees, on your bum, to your feet and up. Okay, why don't we go from the beginning? So from here, circle the arms, arms to the floor, up and circle back, to the floor, up, and circle. Circle, lift your hips, down, together, either slide or jump. Knees, bum, feet, roll it up. So you're in the back corner of your space now. We're gonna take a step with our left one, our left leg, this is kind of like slow-mo running, slow motion running on the right leg. One more time on the left leg. This time we're going to take the leg front and back. And then I'm going to add one more thing. We're going to, from here, we're going to jump together and do rainbow arms. So one after another. At the same time, from here, we're gonna take a step. We're gonna be on the ball of our foot. We're gonna reach to that corner so that we almost, almost fall to that corner, but then our hips take us towards the center and we run in a circle. So let's go from here, from the corner, with the slow motion running. Slow mo running. Second one. Third one, this time, leg, front and back. Jump together, rainbow arms. It's an off-balance movement. 
we run to the center. All right, how's it going? Could we review the whole thing from the beginning? Let's do it. So from here, starting with the circle. Circle. But before that, there's one thing that we're gonna do. And now you are again in charge of our movement. So you get to decide your own movements and then we're gonna add them to our choreography. So then we both made our choreography together. All right. So you can decide what kind of a turn you want to do. And that turn will be on your left leg. So it could be any type of turn that you want to do, starting with the left leg. So any type of turn that you want to do. Okay, do you have it? I'm going to choose this one. All right, so now we have a turn. Next one is a balance position on one foot. Actually, the ball of the foot. And that's going to be on our right leg. So our right leg on the ball of your foot. So you can decide what kind of a balance position you want to do. Okay? I'm going to choose this one. Do you have yours? Let's do them once more together. I'm going to do mine, you're going to do yours. On your balance, good. And one more balance position that's going to be on one hand and one foot on the floor. So one hand, one foot on the floor. So what kind of a balance position do you want to add to our choreography? I'm going to add this one, a star on the side. Good. Okay, let's review our own movements. So you have your turn on your left leg. So your left leg starts. What is it? That's mine. And then we had our balance position on your right leg, on the ball of your foot. Can we remember what is our balance position? Good, and then we have our balance position on the floor. So only your foot and your, your hand. Good, all right. So now we continue from our rainbow arms. We fall out of it, we run to the center. And then it's your turn to do your turn. <laughs> So your turn on your left leg, whatever it is. Continue from here to your balance position on your right foot. And then on here, we're gonna find our way somehow to the floor, to your hand and foot. Good. Why don't we go through that one more time from the, begin uh, from the beginning of our own part. So you do yours, I'm gonna do mine. So rainbow arms, pull out of it.
So let's do it two times from the beginning. We'll do the beginning all together and then the ending is your own. All right. Starting from here, circle the arms to the floor. So that was our choreography that we did together. That's great. I wish I could see your endings as well. So let's do a couple of stretches. Step one foot forward, one foot back. Lower down to a lunge. You can keep the back knee up from the floor or you can lower it down to the floor. Lift your upper body. Feel the stretch in your hip flexion so that your hips relax to the floor and feel the length from your quad to your hip flexion. Take the toes back. Come to the center. Open your knees gently with your hands or your forearms. fun. What was your favorite body part to balance on? I think mine was bum. It's fun to find those arms and legs in the air. Good. 
All right, I hope to see you next time. Thanks for the class. See ya.